everyone. I'm here today working on my little trailer again. It's a 2002 Jayco Kiwi, little 17A. It's got the uh, beds that come out. It's got a queen size bed in the front, full size in the back, a little queen size uh, dinette. Inside, great little trailer. But uh, today I'm going to be replacing the tongue that has quit working. I don't think it was maintained at all from the previous owner. There's little spots on these that you're supposed to oil them or grease them and this one's just completely uh, come apart and I think it also probably got hit as it was pulled in and out of places because the jack kind of sticks down a little bit further than it should when it's all the way up and so I'm gonna show you how to fix this today um, and might seem pretty self-explanatory but this one's a little unique the jack itself actually has a two inch diameter and the inside tube is only one and three quarter which I have found to be very unique there's not too many of those available to where you can actually fit that hole that's down in here is actually only two inches this opening is two and a quarter so what I was able to fix or to get to fit that is a jack where that lower sleeve is short enough to go in without having to fit down in through that second uh, sleeve down in there. So by using this one, it's a two and a quarter on the top, and then the base is, uh, the inside tube is two inches, but this area here is short enough to stay below that other piece. So I'm gonna put that one on and then to prevent it from getting damaged, you can use a foot for the bottom of the jack. That will keep it from coming up too far into that second area, but also it creates a skid so that if the trailer ever does come into contact with cement, or I mean the bottom of the jack, this little foot kind of works as a skid to slide it across the cement instead of ripping the bottom of the, the jack apart. So that's, uh, that's the fix for that. Just thought I'd show you. Thanks. And there we go. It's uh, in place. Works really good, nice and smooth uh, action and fits perfectly. Now I feel comfortable having this plate, the little foot on there. And you can see the old one, this dent in here means it, it hit something pretty heavy. And uh, you get stuff inside there getting rusted because it's not being oiled right. One good jolt like that will knock the gears loose inside it. And that's probably what happened because that one's just totally shot. But uh, this one should uh, work really well. So if you're having that issue where you can't find a, a two inch outer tube and a one and three quarter inner tube um, look and see if you can get one where the part here of the jack will fit within this area and then that two inch tube will actually slide in there I think that's how this one was built and designed to work and at some point somebody replaced it with this one where this was going through and uh, that does give it a little more stability in there but with this fitting in there I feel comfortable with this jack I think it's gonna work great and uh, thanks again for watching subscribe and uh, hit like if you like and I'll see you on the next one thank you bye